I want to re-clarify a point on these dictionaries. Let's say I've got a dictionary here, a Kipadair Hawk Asper Ruff RS Ear. Now the next thing that I want to do is I want to walk through this dictionary and print out both of these items. Now, how do I go about doing that? I'm going to use the items method. The items method will go like this. Now, for each one of the key and value pairs in the x.items, because you have this item over here, item 1, item 2, item 3, that consists of a key and a value pair. So for each one of those items, this is what I want you to do. I want you to print out, um, let's put a string here and a placeholder, and we'll call the, <coughs> we'll put a string and a placeholder, we'll call the placeholder A, and uh, a comma, and we'll put another placeholder, we'll call that B. And I close the parens, uh, close the quotes. Now, it's got a format method. This is how I want you to format this thing. You know that variable A that I just mentioned over here? Yeah. Well, when key value approaches the first item, a kip it there is in key, hawk will go into value. What I want you to do is I want you to take the first one, key, and assign that to A. And then I want you to take the next one, which is the value, and assign that to B. That's how I want you to work this. So when it hits the first item here, the Kipiter goes into key, Hawk goes into value. The format method will take Hawk, put it into B. It'll take a Kipiter, and Oops, it'll take Hawk. Yeah, Hawk, put it into B. It'll take a Kipiter, the key, and put it into A. And it places those two guys there and prints them out. And that's what's going to happen now. Hit enter, enter, and there they are. That's how simple this is. All right, that's all I have to say for now. This is George Bull. I just wanted to re-clarify that point, make sure everybody understood it. Uh, if you if you like the video, please rate it by clicking on the like button. I would deeply appreciate that. And I look forward to seeing you in the uh, very next video. Okie dokie. Bye-bye now.